Willimantic police treating this as a hazmat incident that kept people outside of their homes for hours while the cleanup process were underway. People who were home at the time tell me that they heard a loud noise before starting to see smoke. We opened the door and his smoke just came completely in all of it just came right into the hallway almost like a fog and it was just it was scary it was scary and i had to grab my daughter and just cover her mouth and her face and just run out of there hector rodriguez like many of his neighbors was shocked to find out a fire in his willimantic apartment building 560 on main started from a one pot meth lab on the same floor as his unit to be the door right down for me that's something that I, i've been here for six years I would have never expected something like this to happen. Never, never. Police teaming up with several agencies for the investigation and the cleanup. Yeah, we're currently working with some of our criminal justice partners in the Drug Enforcement Administration and the Connecticut Department of Energy and Environmental Protection, as well as several private contractors. For hours, Main Street was blocked off to traffic and people were forced out of their homes many of them with their pets and children. Um, I came home, everyone was outside. We didn't know what was going on at the time. Um, I was only instructed to stay out of the building. As long as they're safe and my neighbors got them for me, I'm grateful forever. The DEP says two units in the building can't be lived in right now. Police say fortunately, no one was hurt. But neighbors say they're concerned to hear about what's been happening inside of their home. Just that close to home, you know what I mean? That's the crazy, scary thing. I'm just glad it didn't exceed past his front door and he's safe and everyone else is safe in the building as well. Police haven't made any arrests, but say they've identified a suspect. To reference where this happened, the apartment building is right next to the landmark Frog Bridge in Willimantic, so it did cause a bit of a traffic headache, though the scene cleared earlier than police anticipated. In Willimantic, Gabby Molina, Fox 61 News.